Now I want to, uh, I have the pleasure of introducing um, Representative Mark Takano, who is coming from us to representing Riverside, California. So please give it up. Thank you. Okay, and look, look, you know, I'm not, I'm going to be a little more bold and just say, look, uh, uh, no matter what they do, no matter what they do, this is not a fight of a day, a week, a month or a year. It's a fight of a lifetime. We know that, right? We know that, we know that they can, we know that progress is not inevitable. We know that progress can be reversed. We, we thought that eight years under President Obama, that pro, you know, progress is nev was inevitable, that it was an autopilot, but it's not. Uh, and we may be in this for a long time. And just know that there are recourses and we need to take our case to the American people. We need to get everyone to rise up. Uh, you know, he gets on this court, we'll, we, the Congress can add more people to that court. And that's what we'll do. We'll, we'll do what we need to do to make sure that the rights of women are protected. And they talk about, they talk about President Roosevelt being rebuked for quote unquote packing that court. Well, you know what? Have you heard of a, uh, a switch in time saved nine? The, the threat that he was going to generate public sentiment to do that, the judges changed their mind. One of them switched their votes, and they saved nine justices. So I'm not saying we have to go there, but we can go there and know that we can go there. Uh, but my, my druthers, I would rather make sure that we generate enough heat in the next few days so that those senators don't dare do anything to the precious rights of our women in our country. So thank you very much.